Two flags of historical significance that flew in Singapore decades ago were entrusted to a British officer after World War II and years later returned to this country after his death. They were given pride of place at the old Tanglin Barracks. Well, today, Lieutenant Colonel Jeffrey Sherman's family was here to see them on display for the first time. Ariel Lim with more. This was the flag of the Governor of the Straits Settlement, where the three imperial crowns represent Singapore, Penang and Malacca. This other flag was that of the Federated Malay States, used from 1895 to 1941. The two were given to the late Lieutenant Colonel Sherman for safekeeping after the Japanese surrendered in 1945. Upon his death, they were donated by his family to Singapore in 2012. Sherman's son Nicholas and his wife Rosemary were received by Senior Minister of State for Defence Muhammad Maliki Osman at the Foreign Affairs Ministry. Mr. Sherman's father was the one who organised uh, the uh, surrender ceremony and the flags were entrusted uh, to him. The flags went missing in the flux of objects being returned after 1945 and only re-emerged in the 1960s. That's when the Shermans heard of their backstory. The last time we saw them, they were hanging, hanging from the roof of our house because they were so long, uh, there was no other way of displaying them. Um, prior to that, they were flown at my father's funeral. Uh, in 2009. While Mr. Sherman said his father didn't speak much of the war, he had written a 17-page letter detailing its horrors. Mr. Sherman added that his visit to Singapore has been very emotional. Most of all, I think of my father. This is his occasion, not my occasion. These are the very grounds where the two flags used to fly when the Japanese advanced into Singapore in 1942. They were then taken down by British officers and hidden throughout the course of the Japanese occupation. And that's why Mr. Sherman said they didn't donate the flags, they merely returned them home.